Hi you guys, it's Vicki again, just with a real simple 12 by 12 layout. Um, once again, it's 2010 Pumpkin Festival. I, I bet you think if I say Pumpkin Festival one more time, you're just going to hit your head right into the wall. Yes, I know, but I take 1,000 pictures of every event and I feel like I got a scrapbook, 973 of those pictures. So, anyway, it's just a simple little layout. I, there's certain people here on YouTube, I swear they could uh, demo a roll of toilet paper. And I'm like, oh my God, look at that. How'd they do that? I just love to see that they've posted a new video. I love looking at their layouts. And... You know, anytime I find a video on a scrapbook page layout, well, I'm a little bit too excited. It's almost strange. So, because of that, I feel like maybe there's someone somewhere, Aruba, Minnesota, I don't know, like me, and that really wants to see every layout there is in the whole wide world, whether it's good or not, easy or hard. Anyway, so here's a layout. I did this one. Its title is I Found It. And as you can see, it's on plain old orange uh, cardstock. I think this cardstock came out of one of the die cuts with a view uh, paper stacks. It's of my grandson, once again. The shoe I cut from Everyday Paper Dolls. And, well, I'll tell you the story behind this in a moment. But, um, the shoe was cut out from Everyday Paper Dolls. I used my paper piercer thing and poked some holes and ran some embroidery floss through it. The font is cut from a Cricut cartridge, but which one I forget now. Um, put these little banners and little camera, I cut that out of cardstock. The banners are from Cloud9 Design Seasonal Stack last year. I just hand cut those, stuck them up there. My grandson was playing in the pile of pumpkins at the pumpkin festival. And as you can see, he lost his shoe. He came walking out, climbing out of the pumpkins with no shoe on. And I thought, oh my God, we'll be here till closing time. But we did find it, and we took pictures of it. The brown cardstock is from Stamping Up. The ribbon is uh, Stamping Up. I used my Signo Uniball Broad Gel Pen to do the stitching around the edges. I really love to do those little tick marks around the edges. I put my journaling on the side here and that's about it. It was done. This was a real simple layout. You know, nothing fancy. Gets the point across, tells the story, and another page in the scrapbook albums. Um, hope it inspires someone. I used my uh, corner rounder to trim off the edges. Not much more to tell, guys. That's about it. I think this might be the shortest video I've ever done. Hope it inspires somebody. Thanks so much, guys, for watching. See you soon.